Hi everybody, Ryan Dorn here, Internet Consultant, and today we're going to talk about making money with your e-newsletter, generating that all-important revenue. Let's talk about three different things that you can do. First of all, I think it's really important for you to leverage your vendors, your strategic partners, uh, your business relationships, and your business networks. All of those people that you have business relationships with would love to have access to your customers, but how do you do that in a way that protects your customers. Well, actually it's pretty easy and you can make money with it and that is including those folks in your e-newsletter. Perhaps they'd like their logo included. Perhaps they have a special offer that they'd like sent out. Perhaps they have something special that's happening, an event or special promotion. Including them in your marketing e-newsletter as a sponsor is a great way to get them involved give them access to your customers and still maintain a really good relationship with your customers. Now a lot of folks will say, hey Ryan, how much do I charge for that? Well, it's really kind of hard to say, but a general rule in most industries is that you can charge somewhere between $100 and $150 per thousand, meaning that if you have 2,000 individuals that you're sending your e-newsletter out to, you can charge around $100 per thousand. So if you had 2,000 people, you would charge one of your vendors or one of your strategic partners $200 for that privilege. Second idea for you is service groupings. That's where you actually group together service providers, vendors, strategic partners that you have in one e-newsletter. Maybe you group them together around a theme, something that's a real benefit to your users and to your clients, to your customers. Grouping those service providers sort of makes you a resource to your customers. And in that circumstance, it really puts you in a very, very good light. Third thing for you to think about is custom content. See, you have the ability to generate content for other people, for other vendors, for other businesses, and then you have a conduit for that information to be pushed out. So let's just say, for example, that you have a business partner that uh, needs a press release written. Perhaps you and your marketing team can write that press release, provide some custom content, maybe some photography, etc. And then you can include that as a sponsor in your e-newsletter. You know, see, today we have to be really creative. And when it comes to revenue generation, there's one quick and easy way that advertisers, Cons consumers, clients, and your strategic partners will understand that one way is e-newsletters. I'm Ryan Dorn, your internet consultant. We'll see you next time a little bit further down the information superhighway.